Welcome to the AI for Good Global Summit here in Geneva and here on day one. I'm now pleased to have with me Hadas Bitran, I hope I got that pronunciation right. You're head of the healthcare group in Israel for Microsoft. First of all, tell me, Microsoft has a big presence here this week. Why is that? So Microsoft does have a big presence here. That's because this topic is important to us. Uh, we see our cloud, our AI capabilities as fundamental to create a transformation in areas that are important to the world. Uh, there are a lot of uh, things that we do for, in, we do a lot in AI for healthcare, AI for sustainability, AI for, for earth, for uh, accessibility. Uh, we invest a lot in all, in all those domains and uh, it's because it's important to the company. For someone who doesn't really understand the topic, how is AI useful for healthcare? Um, in plenty, in plenty of ways. So um, traditionally, Microsoft had healthcare organizations as customers for 30 years, and we have about 170,000 organizations that are Microsoft customers. And traditionally, we uh, we developed a lot of trust relationship uh, with those customers. Um, uh, they use our cloud. They use our uh, security services. They use Office. They use uh, Exchange. Um, and uh, we realized that the time has come to leverage AI for healthcare and uh, AI can be used in a, a diverse set of areas starting from natural language processing and conversational intelligence to machine vision where a, a machine learning and AI can be used to process uh, imaging, image files and uh, deliver some insights um, to predictive analytics, which is the area of trying to predict something. All of those technologies and, and, and much more, on all of those technologies can be used to uh, improve, to, to contribute to healthcare, to uh, make decisions, support, support solutions for uh, healthcare professionals, to make, it, to make processes easier in the healthcare industry uh, that would lift the burden a bit from the industry, that will improve uh, the processes that would reduce costs. This is why it's so important. Um, now, you're going around all the corridors talking to people. What's your ambition at the summit? Um, I think that uh, um, we are here both to communicate but also to see what type of technologies are being developed in our domain and what can we collaborate with, what we can partner with. Uh, Microsoft has always been uh, a company that works through partnerships. Um, the healthcare mission specifically, uh, like the, the, um, creating a disruption or a, um, a transformation in this industry, is a mission that uh, we be, we can't do this alone. It's not a single company mission that a single company is going to win this game. It's a partner play, and um, this is one of the ambitions that I have. Now, when we're talking about big data and health and Microsoft, the crucial thing is, is this data safe? Um, so I'm, I'm the head of engineering in the, the Israel R&D Center. I can share with you that my engineering teams are going through a, a tremendous scrutiny and tremendous processes for compliance, for security, for privacy, for everything that we do. Microsoft takes security and privacy uh, of data very seriously. A service cannot go into our cloud without uh, meeting the highest bars. Um, so from my engineering perspective, we invest a lot of effort in it uh, to make sure that we don't compromise user data, uh, that we put all the scrutiny and all the processes in place and audit, all the audit trails in place uh, to try to ensure privacy and security. And last question, I mentioned earlier, you're with Microsoft Israel. That's what, a, a key center for R&D for you? Uh, it, is a, it is a key center. The, this R&D center a lot, uh, has a lot of security products, uh, but also a lot of AI products. Um, there are a lot of specialties around conversational intelligence, for example, natural language processing, uh, those types of technologies, but much more. Okay. Well, that was Hadas Bitran, who's head of the healthcare group in Microsoft's Israel division. Thanks very much for your time. Thank you. Thank you.